Hi, and welcome to my course. My name is Kobe Hari. I'm a professional freelance Angular developer, instructor, and consultant. I've been developing client-side web applications for about 30 years now, and in the past 10 years, I've been dividing my time about 25% teaching and 75% developing. So, I want to welcome you to this course, Modern Angular with Signals, The Missing Guide. This course is designed to help you apply Angular signals in real-world projects focusing on best practices. Signals are simple, and like magic, they just work. But using them well requires more than learning the basics. You need to develop intuition on how they work and be familiar with best practices in order to avoid common pitfalls and bugs. So, We'll work on building your intuition by exploring the motivation behind why signals were needed in the first place. You'll understand how and why they evolved the way they did over time. A key part of the process is theoretically imagining how we could build signals from the ground up. This approach will help you develop a deeper understanding on how signals work internally and give you a stronger intuition. A major part of this course is dedicated to how Angular is shifting toward functional programming, relying more and more on signals through its new API. We'll explore how this new paradigm influences the way Angular works and how you can make most of these changes in your own development. Mostly for, the, for those of you who are experienced with using Angular, you will see how relying on signals improve the syntax and simplifies it substantially. Signals can seem magical, but knowing how they operate under the hood is key to avoiding traps and ensuring you would follow the best practices. With this course, you'll gain both the practical skill and the intuition you need to use signals effectively.